Uh, the next question, inshallah, um, advice to those du'at who claim to make peace and unity on the front, well, Zahir, apparently, but then behind closed doors, behind the hijab, uh, they have toxic criticism for other movements, for the Ahlul Hadith, such that they create uh, animosity between the normal brothers and ourselves, such that people don't give us salam, now, one of the worst characteristics in Ellis Man is to be the person the Prophet calls Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam Gul Wataim. Al Yati ila Ha'ulai bi Wachani. Wa Yati ila Ha'ulai bi Wachi. The woman has two faces. He comes to this group of people with one face, goes to that group of people with another face. Just quick to the point. One of the things that I witnessed and I noticed, and people gotta be careful of this, I know some duas of the Sunnah, who are trying to be balanced and trying to have hikmah. Because sometimes that hikmah is not hikmah. It's a khida, it's treachery. Not their fault, it's not aware. Because I found the people who say, hey, have to be wise, let's take it easy with everybody. They will be patient with every group and every idea, except for the people of the Sunnah. They have the least amount of patience with see people of the And even myself, I have to make jihad. I have to make jihad on nafs. So I got to tell you. I got to make jihad against my own nafs. Because I saw how the rough, tough, Sedeki brothers jammed up a lot of stuff. I saw that experience. My own community, African Americans, there's no joke, real situation. Fit in a fold in the whole world, wherever you go. Wherever you go. And I don't like that. But I can't be like the people who all I do is criticize those people. I want those hardcore brothers to be more gentle with other people. So why I'm not more gentle with them then? I have to be gentle with them as well. And not dislike them more than not like that. So that's been my experience. That these people were calling, let's uh, put our hands together and the uh, Folks on the wheel, they all go to the cinder and let's sing songs and everything. And let's sign contracts not to refute each other. And let us, you know, cooperate on what we agree on and, you know, what we disagree. Let's just look over that. I found those people are the um, least patient people when it comes to, why don't you be easy with people to assume? Very critical of that. So I believe if that leaves and proves anything, it proves it's a dowel that's bought here. It's a cat on fly. Um, advice to some of the masajid that um, they call people mashayikh, um, like yourself, alhamdulillah, or some other mashayikh, uh, who are Salafi, they stand for Ahlul Hadith, they stand for the Hadith school, they stand for the Salafi school, but eventually after using them, maybe gaining a following, maybe getting more people into the masjid. After that, they decide to kind of um, get rid of them, basically. Uh, du'a to these masjid are just using du'a. You are young, you speak English, come. You are Salafi, you have a following, come. And after they, they are done with them, plus we don't need you anymore. And just uh, general advice to these masjid and institutes that have this bad attitude to our du'a. Can I ask middle course if uh, um, we would be brutally honest, the goal, the objective should be a dawa in Allah and not dawa to organizations or dawa to ourselves, to our medhat, to our sheikh. So institutions that are really on the sunnah and people really on the sunnah, you have to be very careful about being used in a way where People can make a dalaab and play games with you because that happens. I was invited in London to go to a program with, um, I think it's called MRDF, something like that. Is that the thing? Yes. And I knew I didn't get invited. It was a big program in a hotel. And I knew they wanted me to bring people who listen to me. I said, sure, I'll go. But in the condition, I talk first, I talk last. And I had about seven students with me. So if I talk last, we'll listen to all of the talks. And anything I think should be mentioned, when my turn comes up, I'll mention it. And what I believe is 
wisdom easy and like that. But if I go first, I'm the first one. So when I, they chose me to go first. So I didn't give a generic talk, generic bit of a wide game, the importance of supper, the importance of the birth of the rain. Those are generic, all of them important. All of them important. But the talk had to be clear, the importance of having fundamentals in your religion. That's what the talk was. And it was about what Islam really is and looks like. Not something generic, where you may inspire people, but after you inspire them, they're going to listen to other people when they say all kinds of stuff, which they did. One of the things that was said by the person who was introducing me, and I was first, he was talking to the crown and woman of the crown, and when he gave the definition of la ilaha illallah, he said, la ilaha illallah meant there is no strength except Allah's strength, no power, that was part. So I heard that, that was all I heard. So in my talk, I had to inculcate that in the talk of the importance of fundamentals and principles, meaning what is the Tao to Salafiyah, that was the talk, not generic. We explained to them, La ilaha Allah doesn't mean that. It means there's no God worthy worship by Allah's Jah. So this issue that Hwani has is balance. If we don't take advantage of places when given an opportunity and people give you a chance, don't put conditions on you, you have to acknowledge the way the situation. Are they gonna play games with you? They're gonna play, you know, change your words around. You're being there. They're gonna give you, we're gonna talk about a, 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 a topic that's generic, so that when people are there, they know no difference between you and the next people who came after you, the dial and the talks then. Why go? Don't go. But if you have an opportunity to go anywhere, to give God a lot, and you get that message to the creation, and that's something that is highly recommended. But we have to know today that uh, there are a lot of people playing games. So this whole um, environment of our, um, where and what platforms to go, we have to be careful. It requires some fit and cooperate, cooperation between two eyes. So that we don't appear as if we're sending mixed messages and we're against each other. Yeah.